A man is airlifted to hospital after a garage explodes in Merlin. CTV News with Stephanie Mazzotti. Good evening and thank you for joining us. An explosion and fire in a small Chatham Kent town this morning was felt almost a kilometer down the road. Fire crews from four surrounding communities responding to the blaze in Merlin, that's southeast of Tilbury. And that's where we find our Bob Bellachico tonight. Bob, describe for us exactly what you saw when you arrived. Well, I saw a garage door that was 40 to 50 feet away from the actual structure. After taking a few shots, I went across the street to talk to a group of people who were watching, and they all pointed to one lady who actually went back to the garage, into the garage, to help the man after the explosion. Ladder 49, it just, it just reminded me of movies. Just before 8 this morning, Heather Brooks was on her front lawn with her dog when there was an explosion in the garage across the street. I looked up, the garage, big bang, garage door went flying. The blast on William Street in Berlin startled the 68-year-old. Wow. Brooks says she called 911 and is seen in this security video crossing the street to survey the damage. And that's when I saw the person inside the garage who went in and got him out. No hesitation on her part. Sorry, there was a body moving and I went in. That was it. No, no other thoughts. Brooks says flames were about two feet high when she entered the garage. She grabbed the man by the belt buckle and dragged him to safety as the flames began to engulf the garage. I was scared to death, but I got him. Brooks says she went back to make sure no one was in the garage. The municipality of Chatham Kent says four stations responded to the explosion. It is a very quiet town. Nothing really ever happens here, so this is pretty near unheard of for here. Marissa Shingler heard the blast from her house almost a kilometer away. I heard something and then my windows rattled and then I was out front reading a book and having my coffee and then I started to see the smoke. The man was rushed to Chatham Kent Health Alliance with serious injuries and then airlifted to a burn unit out of town. The cause of the blast is unknown at this time. CK Fire Chief Chris Case is thanking the public for helping, especially Brooks's quick response. I'm praying he's good. Well, I have to say, it is quite the heroic thing that Heather Brooks pulled off here. She went into a fire to save her neighbor. I gave her a hug and called her a hero, which made her a little uncomfortable because all she's worried about right now, as are we, is that her neighbor is okay tonight. The investigation is now in the hands of the fire marshal. Back to you. Okay, Bob Bellachico with our top story tonight. Thank you, Bob. Also